G'day, Damien from Defender 90 Orkney. Um, today I'm starting a new little video segment. Uh, it's going to be called Terrafab Sessions. This is in regards to like maintenance days or working on the car. We have, uh, we are lucky enough to have Peter who has a bit of a factory space uh, that we have called Terrafab because of uh, all the Terraflex gear he has on his car. So we've always been calling it, uh, you know, let's go down to Terrafab and fix this or whatever. So thought I'd start a little video session of uh, us doing what we do when we maintain our cars or work on our cars. So it's called Terrafab Sessions. So today my goal is to, on my roof rack, the um, one of the spotlights when I'm on Ruffer Road moves around because the plate isn't welded in one spot. So I'm just going to put a couple of little welds on that to stiffen that up. I want to drop my coolant because I've been stuffing around with uh, the new Glind shower exchange. So I've lost a bit of coolant and I've topped it up with water. Uh, I have my light above the, the fridge. When I ran my charging points, I think I cut that wire, so I have to solder that back into place. Uh, what else? There's one more thing, I think. What else is there? Maybe my new winch hook. I've got to splice that properly. I want to check that out and see what I can do with that. And Peter is working on his car. He's getting a new red winch, so um, he's starting to run wire and get all that ready for when it comes. So I'm off to Autobahn now to grab some wire and some coolant and then down to Terrafab. So giddy up. So this is the infamous Terrafab. The infamous Peter and his Terraflex Jeep. As you can see, just a little bit of work is going on here. So what are you doing? Uh, pretty much tidying up the wiring, running a new cable for a new winch that I've got, and putting two batteries in the back. What winch? Uh, red winch. Cobra. Which isn't here yet? No, it's meant to be here three weeks ago. So yeah, and how far into it are you? about three quarters of the way to the point of needing the winch here to finish. Sweet. Alright. Let's see what you got more. Guess hopefully it comes in each day now. Sweet. So this is all in preparation for a high country trip we have over Queen's birthday really and onwards but yeah I think that's next trip out for Peter some thick ass cable there anyway let's get to it so yesterday on Alice found a bit of a trophy some bloke, I don't know, maybe we know, maybe we don't, lost front quarter panel. Can we identify who it is by these stickers? Maybe we can, maybe even the colour of it, which is a purple. Got to keep the tracks clean, so I thought I'll take it off there, yeah? take all the rubbish home. Ah, uh, Jimmy. So I sort of gave up trying to empty the coolant because that's just too much of a head fuck. So, ah, uh, whatever coolant came out of now, I've just topped it up. Got the bleed valve off, and it's probably sitting at about the right level now. The 
at some of this stuff. These are good too. Don't mind the old stomping grounds. McLidden Racing. So I just um, got to run the engine for a couple of minutes to bleed this off correctly. So I'm doing that right now. So next job, coolant's all done. I want to, so my light up here, this light that I use for fridge, uh, had a wire down here that I didn't know what it was. So silly me, just cut it and then figured out later that it was the fridge light. So going to solder this line back into these, into these charging port point lines. So, so we have a fridge light again. And then tick off another job. So instead of soldering it into the line, I just ran it into the spade bit uh, for behind these USB points. Just needed a positive and neg. So she's all apples now. Took the fuse out so the ship wouldn't blow up. That's it, another job knocked over. Are you done? I can't do anything at all. Hey, I need the winch and I need those hole cutters. Oh, the ones are through. Yeah, well, they need the crimpers and the so I can cut a hole in pass that cable through. Where do you have to cut a hole? Put a hole in that bottom corner there. And what's going there? Two lot to this. Uh -huh. And where's that switch, the cutoff switch gonna go? Yeah. Like sticking out of that door? Yeah, I'll cut a hole in that door. Yeah. I don't need the glove box. Well, we really look forward to getting you back on the tracks, Peter. Mm -hmm.